be back with another album review. Today's review is on uh, Live at Wembley by Alter Bridge. It's another live album from these guys. The performance took place at Wembley Stadium on November 29th, 2011. The performance was directed by Daniel E. Cattulo III. The executive uh, producers were Stuart Markellis, uh, Chris LaBarbera, and Todd Yates. The, the co-executive producers were uh, Rudy Schlacker, Mariana Schlacker, uh, Carl Schlacker, uh, David Chaisa, Steve Wood, and Paul Geary. The producers were Daniel E. Catullo III, Lionel Passamonte, and Ted Kenny. Post-production took place at Phase 3 Studios. The album was released on March 26, 2012 on The Dude Films. I should also mention that Alter Bridge uh, dedicated this performance to the late Freddie Mercury. There's actually multiple versions of this album. Some come with the DVD and the CD, and others come with the Blu-ray and the CD. And uh, my copy has uh, the Blu-ray with the CD, as you can see. So yeah, there's, uh, there's the Blu-ray. And uh, the CD is right there. And just like with Live from Amsterdam, some of the songs on the Blu-ray were excluded from the CD. Now to talk about the songs, you know, and going over the Blu-ray track list. The beginning of the set list is Slip to the Void. I mentioned that AB3 starts with the song. After that is Find the Real. One Day Remains uh, begins with this song. The next track is Ghosts of Days Gone By. I talked about this track when I reviewed AB3. Next up is Before Tomorrow Comes. The first appearance of the song was on Blackbird. Up next is Come to Life. It's another Blackbird song. We followed up with All Hope is Gone. The first appearance of the song was on AB3. That's followed up by White Knuckles. The song isn't even on the CD. So you need the Blu-ray or the DVD in order to listen to it. Then again, you could easily find it on YouTube. The following track is Brand New Start. This is another song that was omitted from the CD. The track after that is Metalingus. Everyone who's familiar with Alter Bridge knows about this God Tier song. The track that comes next is Broken Wings. This here is yet another song that wasn't included on the CD. The track that follows is I Know It Hurts. It's one of my favorite songs from AB3. The track that comes after that is One Day Remains. This is the title track from the album of the same name. Up next is Cor de Aline. This is another song that originated from AB3. But that, that is Buried Alive. No one wants to go out that way. What comes next is Blackbird. It starts with the cover of the intro to the Beatles song before switching gears to the Alter Bridge song. Now, these guys also did that with the, at the Amsterdam performance. What comes after that is Wonderful Life, acoustic version. First, I think the song translates to acoustic quite well. What follows is Watch Over You, acoustic version. It's another song that translates to acoustic very well. Next up is Ties That Bind. This is track one on Blackbird. Uh, what's next is uh, Jazz T slash Isolation. I mentioned in my previous review that Isolation is my favorite song from AB3. The next track is Open Your Eyes. This is yet another song that isn't on the blue that isn't on the CD. The second to last track is Dueling Guitar Solos. This is where Miles Kennedy and Mark Tremonti go back and forth with their guitar solos. The ending of the set list is Rise Today. This is the seventh track on Blackbird. I couldn't find any information on how the sound formed commercially. 
However, the critics really liked it. And now for my thoughts. I think this is a really good album. In most ways, it's even better than Alter Bridge's Amsterdam performance. My biggest complaint is that eight songs were omitted from the CD. They could have simply put everything on two CDs. If you want the full experience, buy the Blu-ray with the CD. Overall, I highly recommend this album. And now is part of my question you. Have you listened to a live at Wembley? If so, what do you think about it? What's your favorite song from it? Did you attend this concert for yourself? And let me know in the comments. If you liked the video, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Be sure to press the notification bell to notify you of future videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll be back soon with another video.